Now let me show you our more trick as well. Suppose I take a line like y equals 3x plus 2. I'll put a line here, it's different. Um, suppose I take this line and I want to do the same transformation to this line. What's the new equation of the image of this line under that transformation? Well, we're going to do it the same way we did one before. A normal equation says x dashed y dashed is my matrix, transformation matrix, times x, y. But I have an equation here with x and y. What I want is an equation with x dashed and y dashed. So I'm going to find a way to substitute x, y for something else involving x dashed and y dashed. How do I solve this for x, y? I have to pre-multiply by the inverse of this matrix. x, y is going to be what I had before, pre-multiply by the inverse of this. 0, 2 to the power of negative 1. The inverse of this matrix. Well, what is the inverse of that matrix? It's 1 over the determinant, which we decided was 2, times, swap places, change signs. So now I can take this and read off my equations. Actually, I might do one more simplification first. I'm going to write it as 1, a half, 0, a half, x dashed, y dashed, equals x, y. Wow, that was a messy square bracket. Sometimes they get messy. I just put that half inside the matrix. So now, let's read off. x is x dashed, 1x dashed, plus a half y dashed. And y, bottom row, is no x dashed plus half y dashed. Then I'm going to get my original equation, y equals 3x plus 2, and I'm going to substitute. y equals 3x plus 2. Let's put in y as half y dashed. Half y dashed is 3, what's x? x is this thing, x dashed plus a half y dashed, whoops, that was meant to be a round bracket, plus 2. My dog has found a blue tongue lizard. OK, let's expand the brackets. 3x prime plus 3 on 2y prime plus 2. First, let's collect the like terms. The y prime is going to go on one side. I'll put it on this side over here. A half, take away one and a half, is going to be, oh, wait a second, it's negative one y primed. Then on this side, I'm still left with 3x primed plus 2. Normally, we write with a, with a positive here. y primed is negative 3x primed take away 2. So now I have an equation for the image of this line. This is the image of that line under the same transformation that turned this square into the parallelogram. The same transformation will take, I'm just looking for a good colour to use, will take the line y equals 3x plus 2, which is something like this. And it turned it into, if I can get my paper to move, negative 3x, take 2, which is more like uh, this. Now, I'm not being very precise here, but the same transformation that took this square into that parallelogram, also took this line and turned it into that line. 